Hi guys, I'm Ravina and welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make my epic vegan lasagna. This has a red wine tomato sauce, spinach noodles, and a tofu ricotta that's filled with roast vegetables. It's comforting, delicious, feeds a crowd, and it reheats beautifully. What else could you ask for? The first thing I'm going to do is cook my noodles in a large pot of salted boiling water. Today I'm using spinach noodles that I'm cooking until al dente. Then I'll drain and rinse well to make sure that the noodles don't stick together. For my roast veggies, I'll preheat the oven to 425 degrees and then combine a large chopped eggplant, chopped zucchini and chopped colorful bell peppers. Mix everything together with a good few tablespoons of olive oil and lots of salt and pepper. Divide onto two baking sheets and then roast for around 30 minutes, stirring halfway through. Roasting the veggies will really bring out their sweetness, which will balance perfectly with the savory tofu ricotta. I love making homemade tomato sauce for this lasagna, but feel free to use store-bought and save yourself a step. In a large pot, combine a few tablespoons of olive oil and two small onions that have been diced, along with a good pinch of salt and pepper. Cook over medium-low for five to 10 minutes until the onions are starting to brown, and then add in six cloves of diced garlic. Let this cook for another minute or two before adding in dried oregano, dried basil, and chili flakes, and let this toast for 30 seconds or so. Then add in a glass of red wine. If you don't want to use wine, just use two tablespoons of balsamic vinegar. Either way, this is going to bring acidity and brightness to the dish. Let it reduce slightly before adding in two cans of chopped tomatoes and a few sprigs of basil. Often at this stage, I'll add in a pinch or two of sugar because I find that that really helps bring out the brightness in the tomatoes. Let this simmer uncovered for 40 minutes, stirring occasionally, and then taste for seasoning. I like to make the sauce a little smoother with my hand immersion blender. And now finally, my creamy tofu ricotta. I have 500 grams of super soft tofu, to which I'm gonna add two cloves of garlic, a large handful of fresh parsley, nutritional yeast, lemon zest, lemon juice, olive oil, salt, and pepper. And then I'll blend this until smooth once more using my hand immersion blender. This is one of my favorite tools. I'll add my roasted veggies to my tofu ricotta mix and give it a good stir. Now it's time to build our lasagna. Start with a layer of tomato sauce, followed by noodles, tofu ricotta, more noodles, more tofu ricotta, tomato sauce, more noodles, tofu ricotta, a final layer of noodles, and then lots of tomato sauce on top. Basically, you're creating three layers of tofu ricotta and then four layers of noodles in between. And then on top, the tomato sauce is really important because it will prevent it from getting dried out in the oven. Speaking of, I like to add a final drizzle of olive oil and a little pinch of salt just to really bring out the savory, creamy flavors in this dish. Bake at 400 degrees for 40 minutes or until the top is starting to crackle and everything is beautifully cooked through. Remove and let cool for half an hour before garnishing with fresh basil and diving in. I am absolutely dying to dive into this lasagna and have a little sip of wine, but before I do, I need to tell you about the private cooking classes that I'm offering. Since we're spending so much time at home, there is no better opportunity than now to embrace your inner domestic goddess and really become comfortable in the kitchen. And that's what I'm here for. I want to show you simple, delicious recipes based on your favorite flavors, what you have in the fridge, or your dietary requirements. So check out the description box down below to see how I can make a lesson for you in the comfort of your own home.
Lasagna time, baby! So, one of the things that I really love about this lasagna is that it cuts beautifully. You don't get like the epic cheese pull um, of another lasagna, but because there are so many noodles, the structural integrity is solid. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god, yum. Mmm. This is so good. I like how I said it was structurally sound. And then it began to fall apart. It really is structurally sound, trust me. Mmm. This lasagna is so good. I love the spinach noodles because they add another layer of heartiness, but you can use any kind that you want. And the roasted veggies just add such an amazing sweetness and chew to the dish. Also, if you wanted to add some Beyond Sausage or any other vegan meat of your choosing, you could definitely do that for that meaty, chewy bite. But this, to me, is seriously the perfect vegan lasagna. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to be notified when I post new videos. Like this video, tell me what you thought of it in the comments down below, and check out the description box for more information on my cooking classes, and of course, in order to get this recipe. And follow me on Instagram for your daily dose of food porn. With that, my announcements are done. I bid you goodbye, and I wish you a great day. Mm.